My guest here is Jason from BeagleBoard.org. Um, we're going to talk about the new BeagleBone Green Wireless. Have I got that right? That's right. Awesome. The Seed Studio BeagleBone Green Wireless. Oh, okay. precise. My goodness. So, yeah, who all has worked on this? It's Seed Studio, BeagleBoard.org. Yep. Uh, any other players in here? Uh, well, Texas Instruments creates the, the processor that's being used on the board. And I'm, you know, just full disclosure, I'm an employee of Texas Instruments. Mm -hmm. um, but my passion project is, ah. is BeagleBoard.org. We, we partnered with the Seed Studio. They did the, the hardware development um, and a lot of the software work that we're using in, in launching this product. So it's exciting. So uh, what exactly does it have on it? It's got yeah, it's pretty cool. This is um, essentially the BeagleBone Green um, that takes away the Ethernet. And instead, these are these are USB connectors. It puts a USB hub, so you have four USB ports. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, Check so that's it out. a slight differences between that one because it's a prototype, oh. and then this one is the the final version. We've got the, oh. the the chip antenna on on this version. That's not on, oh. not on that one. Yeah, this one's got a wired antenna. Yeah. So do you still have a spot? There's for still there you are do. still there's still spots for two wired antennas. Cool. It's, um, it's got a MIMO Wi-Fi, so it can actually use um, like diversity. I don't. I'm speaking a little bit out of school here, but yeah. but it's it's actually able to do the the, the, the diversity and to get a higher bandwidth cool. on Wi-Fi than what you get with some some other solutions. So the first thing that comes up is this kind of sort of getting started page. Wow. Well, not the first. First thing is the, the Wi-Fi provisioning. But well, that's actually on, hosted on the Beagle. That's hosted off. What? It's actually it comes with a Node.js uh -huh. um, based web server uh, wow. built into it, um, and even um, this IDE. So if you look at um, so port 80, the main um, web port, mm -hmm. you know has this getting started information. You'll see links to things like the the built-in IDE um, based on the open source Cloud9 IDE, and also this thing called Node Red, right? Uh -huh. So it's open source software from from IBM um, for for creating Internet of Things types of devices. You actually, when Eric over at Seed Studio, uh -huh. we talked at the Open Hardware Summit. I'm really trying to make people understand the importance of open hardware, right? So this is one of the big differences between this and some of the other. You know, popular yeah. single board computers that are out there is that people can actually make derivatives. So although you know, we've got the BeagleBone Black that, mm -hmm. that, that you know, we make uh, with different manufacturing partners, right? Seed can actually come and take the design, modify it, turn it yeah. into their own, you know, add their Grove connectors to right, work with their, their ecosystem mm -hmm. and really make the, the product their own. And they, that's exactly what they've done. Yeah. Um, and we're you know, continuing, you know, they've got their, their, you know, their open parts library. Like, so people wanting to do you know, custom variations of this mm -hmm. right, to, to, to make their own project, if somehow they need to change something major, it's possible. 